I'm just going to show you the preheating function. Right, we'll just get the app open and um, we'll show you how you can preheat the car. Once you've keyed your pin in, it says turning AC on, the indicators flash, and there you go, you can hear the, heat, the heating coming on. And uh, we'll see how long it takes to uh, demist. It's 9.56 a.m. and it's sub-zero outside in uh, mid-January. So the uh, active cooling flaps have just opened here after a few attempts because they were frozen shut you can see they're open on the right hand side but not on the left hand side and after only one minute you can see the ice is starting to melt here on the screen So there's the 10 minutes preheating at minus two. It has managed to demist all of the windows, de-ice them at least. And uh, the heat from the heating has, uh, not the rear window heater, but the heat from the fan has uh, pretty much de-iced, yeah, the back window as well. Pretty effective. Now, uh, two things to note. The heating comes on for 10 minutes at a time when you set it in the app and the lights come on during that time, the side lights, the daylight running lamps. That's one thing to note, some people are annoyed by that. And the other thing is that preheating only works at the moment due to a bug when the car is unplugged or plugged in to your wall box and actually charging. If your charge is finished and you try and set preheating in the car, it won't work. Um, this is a bug that MG are aware of and hopefully are working on a fix for. So that's preheating, quite handy. You can just get in, wipe your screen. One thing I noticed was that the camera pod up the top is still iced. Yeah, it's not very, not very hard ice now. So that's just one thing to note. Your camera pod will be uh, still be frozen after one preheat at minus two.